to make your life a lot easier, you'll want to have an oxygen bottle, flippers, and a headlight. And if you can have two or three of them, that would help you out a lot. Okay, so it looks like our flippers and our, our tank are good. Let's get our oxygen up. So if he hits you, it's going to do a little bit of damage, maybe more if you're playing on a higher difficulty. But what you'll want to do is just position yourself right next to the pillars. And then when you see him kind of wind up and kind of lean back like he's about to pounce on you, you want to hide behind the pillar at that point. So let's see. If you do it too soon, he'll just kind of like try to line up again. So let him line up right there, then move behind it. Then he'll break the pillar. So once it's broken, we're going to swim down and grab one of these barrels and toss it inside here. And then once it's inside here, we're going to do the same thing, but oxygen's a little bit low, so let's refill it. Wow, so that's really lucky. So I just happened to line it up as I was refilling my oxygen. It's usually not that easy, but that's best case scenario. So that opened up another level up top here. So we're going to swim up and we're going to do the same thing, but it's going to increase in difficulty every time we go up. So with this pillar, wow, he missed me. With this pillar, he's got the, we're going to have to have him hit it twice. Boom. Should probably get some oxygen here. Line them up. Boom. So now this thing's ready to be blown up. So same as that process, except we had to hit it twice before we threw the barrel in. And then the next, we'll have one more level of this to do. And that'll be the same exact thing, except we'll he'll have to hit it three times. And the area on the column here will be a little bit smaller, so it'd be more difficult. But let me actually get some oxygen, then we'll swim up. Ow. That was a cheap shot. Where is he? Okay, that's one. Just trying to find where the closest oxygen place is. Perfect. Where is he? Okay. Okay, one more try. Yeah, see if you don't, if you don't give him enough space for him to see you, he won't line up the shot like that. So now we have the space for the explosive barrel. I think I dropped one over here. So we can throw that in. Where is he? So let's give him an open uh open shot and then move behind the There we go. Now he's dead. That's going to do it for this guide. If you found this guide helpful, make sure to like the video and subscribe to the channel, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.